uh, an image in here. Um, so first just press the space bar and you'll get your four panel view and then make sure you mouse over the side view here and just press the space bar again. So now we're in our side view and we're gonna bring an image in of a wine glass preferably from the side view. So I already have one saved to my desktop so I'm just gonna use that. You can probably find one on Google Images. So alright. Um let's see which one it is. Alright, so this is a good one. Alright, so the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go up to the top here and click cr create C V curve tool. And well, usually a wine glass is indented in on the bottom, so we're just going to start a little higher up on it. I'm just going to hold X to snap that to the grid, and I'm just going to follow along the edge of this wine glass. Alright, so just place your points carefully along the edge of the wine glass. Alright, so just trace this closely. Can undo them. Alright, once we get up to the top here, we're just going to make a bunch of them. This way, we'll have a nice hard uh, rim for the wine glass. Alright, so now we're going to come back down the other end, leaving a big enough gap just so we have some depth within the wine glass too. Alright, so now I'm going to hold X and snap to the grid again. <laughs> and now I'm going to hit enter. Alright, we can edit the um, points by right clicking and selecting control vertex. So I'm just going to pull this one up real little. Just to there. Alright, so I would say my points look pretty good. So <laughs> the next thing we're going to do is well, you can delete the image plane. Just go to image plane, image plane attributes. Just hit the delete button. And now I'm just going to go into my perspective view and select this in object mode. And I'm going to go up to surfaces in your tool set here and go to edit. I'm going to go up to surfaces here and click revolve. When you're revolving, Make sure your um, options are set to default and revolving in the y-axis. So this is just a you can hit five to shade that. So this is a pretty neat looking wine glass. Um, which is a simple way you can create a wine glass using CV curve tool or the EP curve tool. Um, can do other st stuff with this such as create like tires and things so any comments suggestions um, please subscribe to my videos uh, my next tutorial might be just a simple glass shader for the wine glass